It's couch day! Hello and welcome to the vlog. We're getting the couch today and I could cry of happiness. I am so excited. I've waited for this day for way too long. If you guys are new here, please make sure to subscribe down below. Leave a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. I love chatting with you guys in the comments. And I just want to say thank you so much for all of your support and your sweet comments on my latest vlog. I love you guys so much. You guys are amazing. I feel like I can always count on you guys to lift me up. So thank you. I need to rinse off my self tan. I feel like my face looks a little splotchy. But <laughs> would you like to say hello to the vlog fam? Oh, now you want to be shy? Do you want to say hello? I don't know what you... There's no toy up there, but I do have some cute new baby plants, which I showed you guys how you can't see because of the light. Those two are from Trader Joe's, and then I got this one at uh, like a garden center. But I love it. It's a little baby birds of paradise. She'll grow tall someday, but for now she's there. I've also revived my Monstera. <laughs> And uh, she's already growing a new leaf. I love it. Snake plant is doing well. And same with my little pothos over there. Okay. I need to bring some light in here because it is quite dark in here. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's very overcast outside. So we got to do the usual. First things first, we got to open these up. I can't decide if I want to hop in the shower right now or if I want to sit and do yeah let's sit and do my morning meditation journal daily stoic all that good stuff and uh, I want to make some coffee some mornings I'm like not on it with the coffee like right away sometimes I'd rather have tea but not today I need coffee I need coffee now <laughs> what is <laughs> bud we just came back from inside you have toys scattered everywhere. I did not put them away last night. I got too lazy. You guys saw my Instagram story the other day. Bentley loves to bring every single one of his toys into the bed at night. And I put the baby gate up at night so he knows like, all right, it's bedtime. And I always have to toss his toys over the gate. So I left these ones over here because I didn't feel like putting them all over there this morning. What would you like to say to the vlog fam? Would you like to say happy couch day? Are you excited for a couch? Are you excited for a couch? He's like, yay, another place to lay while you're gone. <laughs> Ow. Okay, coffee time. If you are new here, I read my daily stoic every morning. I am not um, religious by any means, but this is just a nice little thing to read um, in the morning if you're looking for something that's not like so religious based. Um, this is a good thing to have. And then I write in my gratitude journal. This is from Amazon. I love this thing. And then I write in my to-do list notebook. These will have already launched by the time that you guys see um this vlog 
So these are the list of things, notebooks that we have. These ones are on the site. We have them in black and white. And this is the to-do list that we have for today. It's February 4th. I have to edit and upload the vlog for you guys today. Um, I have to schedule Bentley a grooming appointment. I do this once a month uh, to get his nails clipped and just to keep him clean, obviously. Um, but he requires like specific grooming appointment. Um, so I have to always call and make the appointment over the phone. And then the couch arrives today. I cannot wait. I don't know where I'm gonna put the egg chair. Like I genuinely don't even know what to do with it now. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to figure that out. Um, Cause I, I literally don't know what to do with her. We don't have any space for her now. I, I'll figure that out. Anyway, couch arrives, notebooks arrive, and then I have dinner at five. I'm so excited. I think I'm gonna have to move my coffee table. I need to move like anything that I don't want them to ruin out of the way. Um, Cause like with any delivery service, they're not responsible if they break anything of yours. So I'm gonna move like the plant. I have to move all of this stuff out of the way so they have a straight shot into my apartment. So that I need to work on by like 10-ish. I need to just make sure everything is moved and out of the way. Same with like my entryway table, just in case they need that little space to like turn around or something. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna move this stuff on the counter out of the way too, because we do not want them to knock any of that over. We're just gonna make it very easy for them to put everything here. And the couch is like individual chairs, so it'll be really easy to move myself which will be really nice. Um, so it's three seats and then an ottoman, which the ottoman I'm gonna put on the other side just cause we have more si more room over there. And I don't want it to like block off the openness of this room right now. But I'm so excited for, <laughs> I almost said the egg chair. I clearly need to drink some coffee this morning. I am so excited for the couch, you guys. I cannot even wait. Ugh, it cannot come soon enough. Okay. Also, this is a cute new design that we have on the coffee table. Cute new design. Uh, is this even a design decor? That's what I meant. I, uh, I love the concrete accents just about everywhere in my apartment. Um, so I saw this little concrete candle from Target. I mostly bought it for the bowl. Um, I don't know if I'll ever light this because on the bottom it literally says for outdoor use only. So she might just be for decor. Uh, maybe someday when I have a patio I'll actually light this. I don't know. I don't know why it's only for outdoor use maybe someone can let me know that but since it says that on the bottom <laughs> i probably won't burn it in here so uh i mean for now it's just a nice little addition to the coffee table and then we have these coasters and my dior book i don't know if i want to put the candle on the book i don't know you guys let me know what do you think do you like this and how this is because i don't know bubs what are we gonna do with the egg chair what are we gonna do with the egg chair we, are, we gotta find her a new home somewhere because I won't be able to have my mom come get it for a few days. Um, I guess I could just take it apart. She really just mm. will not have any space in here. Love this egg chair, but I bought her in the hopes of sitting in my mom's backyard when I lived with her. And I only sat in it a few times because it was so miserably hot where she lives. So, egg chair will definitely be going back to her house and back in her backyard until I get a balcony of my own. So, that is that. Hey guys, I've showered now and I just finished moving everything out of the way for delivery guys. So we have a clear hallway shot. I should take this up so they don't rip it out of the wall on accident. Uh, I feel like I've had some bad experience with like delivery service people. I don't know, just me. Anyway, the hallway is clear. I'm praying they don't bump into that mirror by accident. I don't want to take it off the wall because my dad like just barely got it to hang. I don't know how he got it to hang, but it's like it's like bolted in there. It's okay, but I like hope they don't bump into it and like accidentally knock it off. But other than that, the hallway is clear. I moved that off and I moved to the plant. We moved the coffee table so they have plenty of room to work. And I got my little vacuum going. Please don't vacuum that up. <laughs> These little orange pieces from the carrot that Benny ripped apart. Um, yeah, my floor is pretty dirty over here, so 
before the couch comes. Might as well vacuum it all up. I literally clean my, vacuum my floors every single day and there's still just so much hair everywhere. But that's just the life of having a puppy that sheds. Welcome to dog mom life. Like look at my chair right now. This is lovely. <laughs> This is why I didn't get like a super light couch. The couch that I got is more of like a white gray kind of color, which will look really nice in here. I think, no, it's not, not even similar to that. That's like more of like a, I don't even know, cream kind of color, beige cream. But the couch will look really nice in this space and I'm very excited. I cannot wait to see how this space comes together today. It feels like it's like moving day all over again. It feels like Christmas. I'm so excited. But this is what the rest of my apartment looks like now. All my plants in the corner over there. The little jungle going on, but I didn't want them to knock into anything. So I also have the glass top right here. Did not want that to break. We are very prepared. My, my space looks so massive now. I think he just tried to jump up on the bed and realized that there was a glass piece here. <laughs> Yeah, don't step on it. Good boy. I am very excited for this day, you guys. And I'm so happy that I get to document and share it with you guys. It's not here yet, but it should be soon. <laughs> the uh, delivery time frame window is 12.30 to 2.30. It's only 11.30 right now, so. I'm eating my leftover PF Chang's that I picked up the other day. And uh, I was gonna go get a burrito from this place because dinner is now canceled. Um, I was gonna go do that for lunch, but I think I'm gonna go get that for dinner and possibly pick up the ingredients for margaritas. I don't know yet. I might just get like margarita mix because that's also easier than buying like all of the alcohol. I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> My uncle has a really good margarita recipe, but I'd have to buy like a bunch of different liquors and ah get down i uh i don't know if i want to fully commit to it yet <laughs> might just buy some margarita mix or something or make some sort of drink later other than having just wine because we have to fully celebrate the couch when it gets here like this, ah, it's so weird looking at it this place feels so big now i feel like it's gonna feel even bigger with the actual couch i don't know how but i'm envisioning it in my mind all right, I just got a call. They are 10, 15 minutes away. <sighs> I'm so excited for my couch, I could cry. I am so excited, you guys. Little, little tears in my eyes already. <sighs> this is probably the most exciting day by far because I haven't had a couch to sit on in a very long time. Not to mention, I just haven't had like a cozy space like that, like mm. just a couch to sit on in years because when i lived with my dad i like lived ate slept breathed in my room like and then it was kind of similar at my mom's because she didn't have a couch at her place she had like two twin beds put together as a couch and it's just obviously not the same feel as a couch so i i'm just so excited to have an actual couch to sit on and like snuggle up on take naps on These are, these are things you get excited about as an adult, I guess. I'm gonna try to record some B-roll as uh, they bring in the couch. So I'm gonna like just set my camera over here and just let them do their thing and set it up. so mad. <laughs> I had to lock him up while they were putting it out here. Let's see. Mom, 
What do you think? I literally never thought I would see the day. I think this cushion is supposed to go the other way, but it's a little dirty on one side. So, I have to reach out to customer service and um, talk to them about that because, yeah, I think it's supposed to go the other way. Um, I think you can do them either way, but I think it's like used to laying the other way. But this is the couch that I got. It is from Z Gallery. This is the Naples couch, I believe. It is down feather blend. Um, it's a really nice, ooh. I feel like there's gonna be parts with this couch that are gonna be messed up no matter where I look. But at the end of the day, we have a couch. That is literally all I care about. She's beautiful. Um, <laughs> definitely feels big for this space. We're gonna have to push her back a little bit. Um, and then I think that'll be better. Cause right now there's not a lot of space between the couch and the TV. So I'm gonna have to push this whole thing back. Let's do that. better for sure um i think i might have to push i don't know i feel like this looks weird with like it not fully on the rug i don't know how you're supposed to do this i've never had a couch uh -uh, don't you dare uh-uh no i'm gonna teach him don't even <laughs> to only lay in one spot probably with a blanket on it because his fur is gonna stick to this it is a like linen-y kind of material. Um, I thought it was gonna be more of like a brushed kind of material, almost like my egg chair, but this is more of like a fabric-y kind of feel. But she is beautiful. Okay, this looks a lot better in here. Um, I think once all of this is moved, it won't feel so cluttered in here. So I'm gonna move everything back and then I will show you guys what it looks like. All right, guys, couch is officially in. I reorganized my apartment. So, plant is back, coffee table and everything. I still feel like, I mean, obviously this couch is like slightly big for this particular space. I think in like the layout, they usually have the couches pushed all the way against that wall and then your TV on this wall for like the layout of this apartment. But obviously we have to have my desk there. So I think the only thing really throwing me off right now is the egg chair because it is so big. My mom will definitely be taking that this weekend when she comes to see me. Um, so I won't have that anymore. Um, but he's a good boy. He has not jumped on the couch yet. The couch is looking good minus the stain. I used cold filtered water and just kind of like dabbed it a little. Didn't really come out. Obviously, they will. I will have to call them and see what they recommend to get that out. He said if I can't get it out, then they will just send a replacement. So, honestly, that is the only thing. That is fine. She's cute. She's comfy. And very, like, closely matches these. So, like, it actually works out. <laughs> these chairs are, like, a similar kind of vibe because it really ties it into the space. But I love how it looks. I don't know if the blankets will stay there or if I will move the blankets behind the couch and put the lanterns back over there. TBD. But now I don't think I need a plant for that corner because I think it would be way too crowded over there. So I think this is like just the right amount of decor in this space now. 
and then spin bike really no other place that we can put her I don't know what I'm gonna do with that table now that was supposed to be like an end table if I had gotten a smaller couch it would have gone like here but that would be in the way of the walkway so of course we cannot do that but uh this is low-key annoying that this doesn't <laughs> link up but it's fine we have a couch and it's fine this is not supposed to go this way with a zipper up like that there we go guys i have a couch i could cry of happiness she's so pretty i love it i love it more than the loving space this couch that i would have gotten she looks so good i am so happy I should probably take the tags off, but it just it just doesn't feel real yet. Get your toy off my couch. Get it off my couch, sir. I'm sorry. You are being such a good boy. You haven't tried to jump up once. You such a good boy. We are gonna we're gonna wait that out a few weeks until I decide which blanket is gonna be your blanket for the couch. But I bet you he's gonna try to jump up here whenever I'm gone, because I have my little baby cam that I can watch him. Ugh, oh, you guys. I'm gonna keep saying that, but I am just so beyond happy. I love this so much. I am sweating though, uh, so I think, I think I'm gonna put some shorts on and just sit on my couch and enjoy it for a little while. Because why not, right? I might even take a nap on my couch. Who knows? We don't have much going on today now. Notebooks are here, you guys. <laughs> I just carried these. Let me just cover address so you can't see I just carried all three of these boxes stacked in my arms from the mail room and I don't live close to the mail room my arms hurt <laughs> so bad these are 17 pounds each but they are here I thought they were gonna ship them all in one like massive box but they came <laughs> in three small boxes which I don't know if that was better or worse to carry them uh, but that was like a whole 50 something pounds of me carrying these up stairs okay I'm gonna open these and uh, then I have photos that I have to take for two of the notebooks because I haven't done the, li the list of things ones yet so I'm gonna take photos of those really quick and set those up on the site and then we will have them in stock so if you guys if there's still some left in stock honestly I doubt they'll sell out that quickly I'm not that big <laughs> on YouTube right now um we only have 50, but I'm sure there will still be some left by the time you guys see this vlog, so go check them out. They'll be linked down below. All right, all of the notebooks are posted online. Does anybody else struggle with this, with the candles? Whenever I, <laughs> whenever I have candles going in my apartment, it always attracts all of the candle dust here. Uh, anyways, <laughs> I... Uh, I knew these boxes would come in handy. So we have the black manifestation journals in here, the list of things journals in there, and the white manifestation journals in there. These are some extras. And obviously as the, the stack gets bigger, I will need more of these boxes. Eventually we will grow out of this <laughs> cabinet and into a warehouse, but this is gonna help a ton hide my inventory so that I can feel at home in my space every other day. Also, just threw all the blankets out because Bentley decided to start jumping on the couch. And, I mean, I don't mind him on the couch. So, we're just going to leave the blankets until I figure out a better solution of, like, how I can get him to learn to stay in, like, one spot so far. He only likes the middle. So, I'm like, okay, I guess I'll start laying in that corner. But I think I am going to go ahead find a movie to watch we're just gonna sit here chill out for the rest of the day and then once um, more orders start coming in later I will start probably packing them but for now I literally just want to sit and chill and not do anything because I just I just did all of that um, and I was very stressed out about the couch today and everything so it is chill time I have hello let's do back out I have a black tea that I'm drinking it's almost gone so I'm gonna have to find something else I might pull out some kombucha but we're just gonna chill here and watch a movie it's it's black tea but <laughs> the look of confusion on your face yeah I just went outside for a little potty break so he is good until dinner so now we can actually relax huh you ready you ready to relax and lay down he's so interested in the can <laughs> This is my first time off of the couch all day. <laughs> Bentley and I have just been living on the couch the entire day and 
I'm not mad about it. I just took him out for a walk and uh, now I have these cute little friends coming in on my chin. That's so fun. It's almost the time of the month. I love that. I, uh, I'm working with Green Chef. Um, in a few videos from now, you guys will probably see this, like, the collab with them in a few weeks or next week or something. Um, but they ended up sending me quite a few meals. And now my refrigerator is filled with them, so I want to make one tonight. So I'm hungry, and I just gave myself a paper cut. I do not feel like going out to spend money when I have a refrigerator full of food and these burgers sound amazing, so that is what I'm going to make tonight. Um, I like a something burger one I could. The Monterey Jack burgers and like zucchini fries. It sounds so good. I am feeling major comfort food vibes right now, so that is what I'm going to make for dinner. Hello. I can't even focus the camera. My whole body is tired. I should have taken a nap today after I got the couch, but I did not. I really, I really needed a nap today, and I told myself that, and I knew I wouldn't get one today, but then I ended up totally having time to, and then I just didn't feel like I could fall asleep. What is that noise? I don't know. Okay. Let's make some dinner. I don't have any cold wine. So I think I'm gonna put some wine in the fridge and then hopefully it will be cold by the time dinner is done. Good morning, guys. I don't even remember finishing off the vlog yesterday. I don't think I did. I am sitting down right now to package up all of the orders that came in yesterday. That is what I need to do. What I need to do today, Bentley is full of the squeaks this morning with his tennis ball. Um, but I have, we are like half sold out. Um, I got a few people yesterday that were messaging me saying they were confused, um, they couldn't find the manifestation, like plain notebooks, but they are all under the same um, section. <laughs> so when you click on the manifestation notebooks, like you can do the drop down menu and click the different designs. Uh, so I just changed the cover of them just so people were not confused anymore. Oh my goodness, he's like parkour. So I did that this morning, um, and now we got a few more orders coming in, so I might as well just pack them. I'll probably just pack all the orders that come in um, while I'm packing orders since I'm already doing it. Uh, so if you guys ordered today, Friday, while I'm packing orders, you're lucky because you get your ship today. Everyone else, if they order it later today, the orders will not be shipping until Monday when the post office is open again. So I'm gonna get to that. Made myself a cup of tea this morning. We woke up pretty early. I was up at like 6.15 this morning. It's already 7.30. I've kind of wasted quite a bit of time this morning. Uh, okay, on to packing notebooks. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. Do just what you want. I just finished up all of the orders packing all of these I need to put them into a bag I honestly need to like get one of those massive Ikea bags so that I can bring stuff to the post office easier uh, but I'm gonna put them in a few bags and go drop them off at the post office for the day and then we are done with orders for today and I'll worry about packing more over the weekend as more orders come in we still have Quite a few manifestation journals left. We are basically all sold out of the list of things ones, so I will definitely be ordering more of the list of things next time and less manifestation, because it seems to be how it went. I think a lot of people are waiting for like the marbled manifestation journals, so we'll be ordering a ton of those and probably less plain black and white and then more list of things. Do you guys want the list of things with the marble design on it too? 
like should I should I create that I don't know I'm also coming out with like a third journal option that's totally different than the other two but I need to finalize the design on that and order a sample and see what what that's gonna be or what that's gonna look like uh, before I can fully release that design so third third journal option coming um, but yeah we okay, gotta take these out of the post office and then I still have a busy rest of today so let's go let's go do that hi guys I can't remember if I ended off the vlog yesterday or not I ended up meeting um, some friends at lunch and then my friend and I went to a plant store and found some cute little plant babies so we have this beautiful new addition sorry the reflection of the sun in the mirror so pretty and then I got another pothos and this one is just thriving I'm so excited to let it bind down right here and I think that's all the new plant babies out here and then in here whoa the sun is like coming in strong today I got this beautiful fiddly fig the leaves are just the prettiest thing I have ever seen so beautiful I love it and we've got a new little baby sprouting right there so this one is just gonna keep growing tall. I was gonna get a tree for this area, but I ended up liking this one a lot better than the trees that they had available. And this one is just so beautiful. I love it, I love it so much. So now I have, I feel like this part of the room is like complete now. Also just totally ran into my lamp. Um, Bentley's bed is gonna go back in the, I think that's a smudge on here. <laughs> I just realized that was a smudge on my camera creating that little light effect, but okay, here's a beautiful <laughs> view of my fiddle leaf fig now. Love her, she's beautiful. Uh, like I said, the, uh, the egg chair is going today. My mom is coming by later in the afternoon, so I actually need to take the egg chair apart this morning, so I can give her that. And then I think what I've kind of decided is that I have too much stuff going on like along this back wall right here. So I think I'm actually gonna offer this to my mom or I might sell it. And then I might just get like a tiny little circle bar cart that will go just right here and kind of like hide in the corner over here. Um, and that way I can just have Bentley's bed right here and that'll open up this space a lot more because I feel like it's just a lot of stuff like in a row. I don't know, maybe that's just me, but um, I also have these fake plants over here that I have a few listed on Poshmark, so if you guys are interested, um, I have been trying to save a big enough box to be able to ship that on Poshmark, but I think, I think all three of these should be on Poshmark now if you guys want to check those out. But love my couch still, she's beautiful. We've got all the blankets covering her still because Bentley's fur is just so dark, but I love that this isn't like the cloud material couch. You don't have to like constantly fluff it. Like it'll just always look good. Even when your little pupper sits on it. Well, he's not little. He is pretty dang big. <laughs> okay, Bubba's. I also did a little TikTok this morning sharing the notebooks. And then I shared that on Instagram Reels. I've been trying to be good about sharing my TikToks on Instagram as well. Because I know not a lot of you guys have TikTok. What's up, Bubba's? You want to say hi to the camera? Yeah. Oh, my sweet boy. All right, guys. That is officially going to be it for today's vlog. Love you guys. And I'll see you next time.